Welcome to this tutorial on creating consistent character models using Scenario. In this video, you'll learn how to create a custom character model that consistently generates the same character across a variety of situations, poses, and expressions. This method will significantly streamline the creation of game assets or other media, enhancing both the speed and efficiency of your workflow. Step 1. Building a strong dataset. The foundation of a successful character model lies in a well-prepared dataset. Here are three key factors that will ensure your dataset is effective. High resolution. Images with a resolution of 1024 pixels or higher are ideal for datasets. High quality visuals ensure sharper, more accurate results, while lower resolutions may cause blurrier outputs. If needed, you can use the Enhance tool to increase the resolution of your images. Consistency. Ensure all images in your dataset show the same character with consistent features like hair color, eye color, skin tone, or even outfit. This helps the AI reliably reproduce the character in different contexts. Versatility. Include images of your character in different poses, expressions, and angles. This helps the model generate diverse outputs while maintaining the character's identity. Here's an example of a poor dataset. Notice how the images barely vary, featuring nearly identical compositions. This results in repetitive outputs. By following the tips above, you can achieve more dynamic results, giving you greater flexibility with your prompts. Step 2. Training your model. Next, navigate to the Models section and choose Train your own model. Select either the Flux or SDXL base model and upload your dataset. If you're working with SDXL, it's highly recommended to add detailed captions to each image. This provides the AI with more context, helping it to understand your character's features more precisely and produce accurate results. Click Train and wait for the training to complete before using the model. Step 3. Testing your model. Once your model has finished training, it's time to test it. Start with a simple prompt that clearly describes your character's key features or pose and experiment with different prompt lengths from concise to more detailed. Add the art style for the finishing touch. You can also use Prompt Spark as a starting point, as it generates prompt suggestions based on the captions in your dataset. Now that you have a prompt describing the character, you can add prompts for the pose, expression, and background of the image. This will give you more control over the final output, allowing for a more dynamic and complete scene. You can easily change your character's features, such as their clothing. Keep the prompt focused on the character's core features and simply modify the clothing description to easily generate different outfits. After generating a few images, review the results and select the best ones. Pinning images will improve the Prompt Spark feature, which fine-tunes future prompt outputs based on your pin choices. Step 4. Finalizing your model. To wrap things up, ensure that you provide a clear description of your model and a visually appealing thumbnail. It's also a good idea to tag your model or include it in a relevant collection for easy organization and access. And there you have it. You now know the essential steps to create consistent character models using Scenario. This process will help you streamline asset production for games, illustrations, and other media projects. If you want to explore more advanced techniques, check out our Knowledge Center for additional tips, tutorials, and resources. Keep creating, and we'll see you in the next tutorial where you'll learn how to further refine a model to increase the quality of generated images.